the same height. Um, I can't remember what's going on top. I'll have to check my book. So that's our high end. So no bed at the top. I'm just run it down this way. I've dug down there about a foot. That's just an extra bit of concrete for the pillar. Had a bit of a late dinner because we were. We keep saying we. I. So there's our pillar. Hello again, and um, we're on to our next, this is our, my second job, solo job. So it's a garden wall, and the customer's already dropped it. So I, don't, I might have a picture of it. I'll put the picture up on the screen now if I can find it. Um, yeah, wall came to here. There's just a metal post there. As you can see the hole. And there's a metal post there. Now we're coming back to here. And I'm going to cut this out and stone it up and then it's going to get to the rest of the flagging. I'm sick of getting stuck in this comments about doing flagging so I'm not doing that. I'm just going to stone it up ready. And then we're going to have this wall. Barry's are delivering the bricks today. I'm not sure what time. And then it's going to go this height. Um, Chepstone Multis I think they're called the bricks. They're like the nice looking brick. They've got a lot of um, purples and orange so similar to that, similar to the house. See the colours in the house. So yeah, same height. Um, I can't remember what's going on top. I'll have to check my book. But, um, yeah, that's it. On this end we're going to put a concrete post in. Dig this out, put a concrete post in. Uh, ready to hang gates on. So I'll be putting the post in here today. And then that will have gone off then. I can just hook a line straight through then. So that's it. Um, we're going to get, get all this cleaned up. I've, um, I've got the gear with me to redo the foundations, but the, the foundations are looking plenty wide enough. And it's not a massive wall, so I want to get the golden gear, get it all cleaned off with the, uh, with the Titan. See how it looks, and take it from there, and hopefully some bricks will have arrived by then. Here's the brick jacket ready to cover them up. So yeah, catch you in a bit. Okay, we're all good, all cleaned off. Not really level, but it's up and down. But I'm going to bring the um, 12 fiber lights from home, drop them in the bottom there, get leveled up with the fiber lights. <clears throat> that brings more or less up to the flag level. I've ripped the edging out, there's a flag, I'm going to cut that now with the stilly. Then chuck some stone in there, I'll maybe do that tomorrow. And then get over here and start digging this hole. Get back to that in a minute. We've got the big break with us for that, and I'll just get on this bit now. Tidy this bit up. And get back to it. find a post, not one of these posts, just a square post. So there's the shite, it's going to skip in a minute. I 
I've got my level out, so check the levels on this wall, find out where the high spot is and that's where you start from. Um, get this bit dug out now and then um, pack all the tools away and head over to B&Q or uh, Selco's over at over the entry, which isn't far up the road, and have a look see if we can get this post. Uh, like I say, berries is due any time, so I think we're going to get them put on the grass. Right in the middle, I can just spread them out then as I work. I need the van off the pavement, and it's a like, two, four, six, eight, nine foot wide pavement, so plenty of room for me to work and for people to get past. So, um, get your hands off your keyboards. <laughs> uh, yeah. Big break is done with. All the digging stuff's done with. Just a bit of just need a spade now, so I'll get all that put away, tidy up, and then we'll get the spade out. Cover that hole up while we're away. Don't want anyone falling down that. Yep, there we go. I think I'm ready for lunch. I think it's just gone 12. Yeah, Jeremy started. Just remove the laser level, so that's our high end. So, no bed at the top, I'm just run it down this way. I've dug down there about a foot. That's just an extra bit of concrete for the pillar. We're having a brick and a half pillar at this end. Uh, I need to pick up a grey top from huge grey for that. And we're having blue engineers for the rest of the wall. Covered that hole up until I come back with the post. So, I'm going to clean the field up now. Pack everything up and head off and try and get all of this um, this year post. That's got to be in today because that's going to be my profile for running the line. So I can just pull the line straight off that, put a corner block on it. So yeah. Uh, get back to running back. And we're back. It's getting on for three o'clock now. It is quarter to three. Had a bit of a late dinner because we're. We keep saying we. I was driving around, went to be and went to Wicks, went and ended up at Joseph Cars, but um, near Switch Island and Entry. Got our post. We've got a round top and a flat top. We're having a round top, and it's going in 26 inches down. The lead is sticking out the top to match this pillar, which is going to match that. Perfect. So, um, yeah. Half on, half on with a mix. Just finished digging out the hole. We've got the post in now. Got the clip, clip, clip. Got the clip, clip, clip. Five to four. Well, it's been a frustrating day. Obviously, the bricks I've got today's mixed up, and the bricks are coming tomorrow. I thought they're coming today. Um, anyway, we've, we've got the footing cleaned off. We've got our levels in. I know that's a low spot. That's been dug and concreted. That's about a foot thick. That concrete. Right there. I've still got this little section that I dug out, and got rid of. That's to be flagged down later by somebody else, not me. And the post is in. when they want to hang some gates. I've actually took it back a bit so it's flush with the uh, post so it's not sticking out. We've, we've pinched 
nearly a foot this side to make the drive a little bit wider. So that's it. Catch you in the morning when the bricks have arrived. Good morning, and it's the, is it the third. Bear with. Third of August, quarter to nine. I've just got here. Put a few blocks up on the way to get this bottom course in. Um, obviously, no bricks or sand here, so we've just run berries. The wagon is probably about six miles up the road on his way to us. So yeah. I'm going to get everything up, get everything set up now, get as much done as I can, get myself ahead, get all the blocks laid out, and uh, get ready for the sand and the bricks too. I think I get bumped out then. It shouldn't take me too long to get the bricks dropped there. So yeah, catch you in a bit. Right, it's quarter to ten. It's warming up a bit now. Let's see the rest on now. So, progress update. No sign of berries yet. Hopefully they'll land anytime soon. And everything's ready. Mix is set up, buckets are filled up, electrics out, uh, hose pipes out, laser levels out. I've transferred a laser level from the top of that wall to onto our post. So that's our level line. That's level three. And then I've gauged the wall, it's four to a foot, so it's three inches per course, not 75. So I've gauged back down. So I've got down to 27 inches, which is nine courses, which I can do off this. It's not very, not very plumb, so I can use it as a range and a gauge. And I'll just plumb each, each brick on that corner as we go up. It's just quicker than building a pillar. Uh, if we didn't have that, I'd have the old trench spot with the profile stuck, stuck on there. Yeah, there's a pier cap ready to go on. That's it really. All up on that and everything gauges in. Took this off because it was loose. I'm gonna relay that. Customers asked me to do a couple down there on the M1 there too. Next door. Yeah. <coughs> so yeah, it's just sit out and wait now. It's gonna be um, it's gonna be a hot one because the sun's probably on me a lot of the day. And it's gonna be a long one now because it's a late because I want to try and get this finished tomorrow. That's the other job. So there you go. That's a, a quick update. Fantastic, that level. Fantastic. Worth every penny. So yeah. I'll, next time you see, you see us, meaning me and the driver, there'll be a berries wagon offloading the materials. I'll catch you there.
Mixes on because the sand's red, obviously. And I just said to the driver Rick, great driver Rick, I just said, Can you can I have permission just to use the footage in my YouTube channel? Still, yeah, to watch your channel. So we have a new subscriber. Rick, the very driver's our new subscriber. That's what it is. So now everything's here, mix is on, and while the mix is on, I'm going to spread 200 out to get me going. I don't want to load too many out because I'm not going to get finished today. so just put a manual in my mouth, I'm just add to it if I need to. So I'm going to get a bit of tongues. While that mix is spinning, I'm going to get some books to get out. We'll catch you in a bit. There we go. I think it's about half twelve. Oh, course it's twelve. Oh yeah, Jeremy's not on yet. Course twelve. I'm gonna have my dinner now anyway. No, I'm not. I've got to run that back in. Then I'm gonna have my dinner. Get this stuff used up after boards. It's not in the sun. Yeah. So there you go. It's all set out. First course of lock in. Started at that end. 
completely the bond the same as the next door's wall just trace the bond through and then wherever the bond landed that's where the pillar lands so it works out just right so there you go i'm going to get a line up stuck on the back and just run that that back section in a bit of a struggle with the bad it working that low so it's got any cushions so. so there we go let's get this last bit in and then have some lunch
There we go, it's three o'clock. Oh, this car's not empty. So there's our pillar. There's our wall. Lovely brick, these. Chelwood Multis, I think. Turka Chelwood Multis. Yeah, nice. So, I've got probably just under half a mix left. So I'm going to chuck a line up and use the mix up. Job and knock. So, yeah, um, might need a few bricks loading out just to finish off, but I'll just get them as I need them. So that's it. Post is all done. Pillar's all done. Looking good. Let's get, this. Let's get some more bricks in.